Hi, welcome to the video training of Node.js. In this video training, we will be learning about how to create a video chat application using Node.js. We can create video chat similar to Zoom using Node.js and the modules we need for this are Express, HTTP, Socket.io, UUID and EJS. Okay. This is the program that we are going to write in Node.js. So we need to require the Express module, the HTTP module, the Socket.io module, and the UUID module. We also need to set up the EJS view engine, which we'll be using for serving the HTML file to the browser. Then we define the landing page route, get, and in that we are redirecting the user who have joined it to a new room and above this we have the room route where we are getting the room id from the parameter then we are creating a connection and it is done with using socket.io library in which we are using the join room event and the disconnect event and in both these events we are broadcasting the emit user connected or user disconnected along with the user ID. This is our HTML file where we are including the constant room ID right here uh, among the script tag and we are also including the peer JS library which is used for communication between the two users. Then we have the socket.io library then when we have the script.js file, here is the style tags for video grid and the video object. And in the body, we have the video grid ID. Okay. Then we have the script.js file. In this file, we are basically defining methods that will be used for creating the room and the video environment, which is used to communicate between the two users and also access the media devices on your computer. For instance, the method navigator.mediadevices.getUserMedia is used to access your video camera and the audio device on your computer and the browser will ask your permission if you are going to allow it to use for this application or not. Then we have the MyPeer object and the call event which will be going to answering the call and adding the new user to the room. Then we have socket.on user disconnected event and mypeer.on open event. At the end we have connect to new user event which will receive the user ID and the stream object and this is basically for adding the user to the old user. And then we have call.onClose event which will remove the video from the browser. And then we are adding the peers user ID equal to call. Then we have function add video stream which will receiving the video and the stream object. Here we are creating the video dot source object and assigning it to the stream object. And within the add event listener method we are going to play the video and video.grid append video. The video object will be append, uh, appended into the video grid object. That's all about the code and you can download the whole source code from my GitHub repo repository which I'll be sharing in the video description. Let's see this example in action. So I'm going to run the server here. sudo node server.js it will be running on port 3000 let's start the browser okay okay i have minimized the window so i can open two windows as i am the only sole user for this application we need to test it in on the same machine so i'm going to open the incognito as well copy this URL here because I want to join the same room as in the main browser window. So that's how you can create 
video chat application using Node.js and the peer library along with socket.io. So you can test it on the local area network as well or on the server. You just need to replace localhost with your IP address and you will be able to experience this application with your friends in the university network or your company. So this was all about creating video chat using Node.js. I hope that you have enjoyed the video and you will download the source code and try it on your own computer and you, with your friends. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you next time with a new topic in Node.js.